we were talking about the unique things today about BT. So, one of the unique things is the bond which the institute, the teachers share with children, which continues even years after they have passed out from Bakliwal tutorials. The last year's topper, felicitating this year's topper. So, Gazab Nurka Thao. So I think Pratik is baat ka Pratik hai as I always say that toppers can have a well-rounded personality. A excellent combination of high IQ and EQ. Can we have a big round of applause for Pratik as well? Um, to start with, big congrats to everyone from the 23 batch. Uh, I'll be I'll be very honest with you. I didn't know I was supposed to give a speech here, so I don't have anything prepared. You know, I practice how to give flowers to Aniruddha, but that's about it. Uh, so. See, there's two things I want to talk about, and the first one is like um, BT as a culture, right? And I know it sounds like something we're just staying on stage, but when all these students go to college, you'll realize BT does have that culture that 99% of institutes don't. You know, where you know every, every single one of you who's on that stage, that who's been you know felicitated today. You don't know about it, but we have been talking about you, all our seniors. We've been talking about your results in different exams, your preparations, every time you guys reach out to us for help. And we do take an interest in how our juniors perform. And I'm sure next year you guys will be taking an interest in how your juniors perform as well. And that's because BT wasn't just a place where there's a good preparation. There are a lot of coaching institutes that do that. But BT is a place where you feel comfortable enough to, you know, share and talk and just be like, be a part of something bigger than you be a part of the BT family, as we call it. So I just want to congratulate not just the passing of students, but everyone who's a part of the BT family. The parents, the juniors who are the 24, 25 batch, the seniors, apparently I'm the only one here, and all the teachers, all the faculty who goes unnoticed, you know, making things work in the background. So please, a huge round of applause for everyone. Um, there's just one short thing I'm going to say. I'm not going to take up too much of your time. I know everyone's in a rush to get out. But uh, one thing we overemphasize too much about J-Advance is the numbers. AR, XYZ, so-and-so rank in KVPY, whatever. But one thing we don't talk about is how, like, um, like I'm going to quote uh, Aniruddha's uh, father here. I greatly agree with something he said. Uh, to me right now on stage and that is the JE advance is like a very big hurdle and clearing itself is a very uh, large um, I don't know what to call it, achievement right and it's not really about the rank that you get it's about the fact that you were given a very tough task to do and you were told to figure it out and it took you two years it took you failures it took a lot of pain and hard work but at the end of the day you took up a task and you got it you cleared it and that is what really I feel turns a child into an adult. And that's one thing you can rely that's that's one thing you can rely on these students from now on. That now they know they they know PCM very well. Depending on where they're going in life, that may or may not help them. You know, they know about how to attempt an MCQ paper. That's probably not going to help them in college. But one thing that they did learn in these two years is how to deal with problems. And that is an underrated skill. It's not something that can be put into words. I can't tell you exactly what kind of problems or what kind of emotions to control or what. But when you've been given a hard task and you take it up and you complete it, you become someone who can do it again and again and again. Today is the first big step in all of these kids' lives. It's the first big hurdle they've completed. There's going to be a lot more, but I'm sure everyone's going to do great. So all the best to your guys' future and thank you. Thank you so much, Pratik, for coming. Let's go take the Himmat Joe, I would just go near the